Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Mr. Rock Sound, it's Dear Rambles. Today is the Arrow crossover episode with everybody, and it's season 4, episode 8, and it's called Legends of Yesterday. So we start off with a flashback at ancient Egypt, and they have sky rocks, and they fell to the earth, and they were glowy and purple. And then we have the present day where King Kendra is starting to remember stuff, but, um, but not really a whole lot. And then you have the Geek Squad, as Oliver calls them. And he gets called out on it. And they're like on, on the outskirts of Central City. They have Oliver being kind of shady. Because <laughs> uh, of the whole sun thing. And they have Kendra and Cisco talk. And they have Connor uh, kind of interferes. And then they start training. And then Oliver is literally just stalking the ex and wants to talk to her. And so um, he knocks down the hat and get, cleans it and slightly takes the hair and puts it in his pocket. And then we have, uh, then we cut to more. Malcolm arranges a meeting with Savage with between Oliver and Flash and everybody kind of like that. Does not go well and they have 24 hours to literally get um, every, to turn over the Hawks. Kendra and Connor. Uh, so then we found out that Flash ghosted and saw himself in when he was running back and then we have Kid, so then Kendra wants to kill themselves but instead they train and they found a tape explaining Savage by this uh, professor in I think the 60s or the 50s somewhere in there and they have Barry uh, ran the uh, ran the test uh, that Oliver gave him and the DNA matches then Felicity comes in he literally gets the paper because she goes all crazy pants on um, Oliver about it and then she knows because she's seen his genetic, genetic markers forever so she already knows what it looks like. So then, um, then we cut to Oliver drops in on the X, and then she finally spills the beans, and says like, "If you want to see uh, your son, he can You cannot tell anybody." And he agrees. And then Felicity confronts him, and then she gets pissed. And then we cut to where they hand over Connor and Kendra. And, um, but they don't, and it's a great fight scene, but Kendra doesn't emerge, and then Carter and Kendra die, and then when they take the gauntlet and try to turn it back on to Savage, it doesn't work. And so everyone dies except Barry, and he goes back in time, and Barry tells Oliver that he traveled back in time and tells him everything that happened. Then Oliver tells Cisco to triple check the gloves and for and for him to talk to Kendra and then um Cisco tells her to focus on the priestess part and the reason why she keeps blocking it out and why she's having trouble emerging is because she doesn't want to accept what's happening so then Cisco helps her remember and then she remembers her first death and sees a dagger and then they go back to the fight time and then they kill Savage I must have jumped over some stuff. So I'm going to rewind. So basically what, um, after, after they see what, um, what, after what Kendra saw, so they talk again, and then Felicity talks to Oliver outside, and they pretty much basically almost break up because of what happened, and also for Barry ran back in the time, and I don't know why I skipped all that, I don't know. Anyway, so then, um, so anyway, so she sees her first step and sees a dagger, so they go back to the fight scene, and then they kill Savage, kill Savage, and then Kendra says goodbye to Cisco. Then Cisco gives her a gift and basically molded the metal that was uh, created into like a bracelet and gives it to her. Then Barry talks to Oliver and they hug, and Oliver's not a hugger, so. Then Oliver goes to see his son and won't say anything. And they have a Elicity time. They have Malcolm Shadiness where he gets ashes of Vandal Savage. And that's in the episode. 
very confusing because when I was watching the two crossovers together, I felt like the scenes they used in the Flash episode were supposed to be used into the Arrow episode because when he first came back, he tells Cisco about what happened. He's like, don't say nothing, don't say nothing. So, um, it's very con kind of confusing on that. So, I got very confused. I was like, did I need to see the first part again? Because did I miss something? But I didn't. Anyway, very confusing crossover episodes, but I, I still very much enjoyed it. So, I'll give it some B plus. It was really good. That also might have been my brain was overloaded and I couldn't think straight. It's totally possible. So, that's going to be the end of this episode. So, if you like this video... Why is it the end of this episode? If you like this video... This is the end of the video! I can't even say I'm not... No. Anyway, so if you enjoyed it, please go to like, comment down below, and subscribe for more stuff coming up. And have an awesome day. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.